coffee so good when you're so tired. Good morning, everybody. Last night, oh my goodness, last night was torturous. I'm glad that I wrapped up work early, early, before midnight, and went to bed at like 9.30 because Weston was up every single hour last night. And I'm thinking like, why? Because he's starting to get a little bit better, you know? A little bit better. Instead of sleeping two hours, he sleeps two hours and seven minutes now. <laughs> uh, no, but sometimes he sleeps, like, he'll surprise me and sleep in a three-hour stretch instead of a two-hour one. And he was starting to get better with that. And I'm thinking, why is it that last night was so awful? And then it, I, it occurred to me that he's almost nine weeks old and going through the nine-week growth spurt. So not much is going on today. I don't want you guys to expect that this is going to be a super fun, exciting day. But I'm taking the kids out shopping for the first time alone. Now, I've taken the kids out to the park before, but I've never had to, like, try to configure carts and stuff. I think what I'm actually going to do is forget about the cart and just take the double stroller. That might be easier. Um, or I might wear Weston and put Ellie in the cart. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Figure it out. Hungry? Delivery day. Work time. Say hi. 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 My. Ah, uh, my. Name. Name is, is Ellie. Uh, Ellie. You're Ellie, that's right. You got some dirt on your face from your snack. A snack? Yeah. I want a snack. What's on your shirt? Snacks. What's that? Shirt. What's this? What is it? What is it? What's this? Is that an ice cream? Ice cream? Oh, no. Nah, she's distracted by the wiggles. <gasps> what color? Do you know? Green. Green, that's right. What other color is there? What are you doing? Uh, uh, Give me a kiss. Uh, hey guys, so it is now just after five and I wanted to tell you about how the shopping trip went because I never really got to record anything except that little clip of Ellie playing. So when we went to go shopping it was pouring, pouring rain and I had no choice but to go out because I needed toilet paper. <laughs> so um, I had to take the kids out and I ended up using the double stroller which was pretty good and um, you know, the rain made it suck. We would have survived. It would have been better if it hadn't, hadn't have been for the rain. But I feel like I am, like, finding, um, my groove and I'm feeling more confident. Um, this is the first time I did that by myself. Um, first time I had to worry about how I'm going to, where I'm going to put the kids exactly, how I'm going to configure everything. And it was fine in the end. Weston is a much, um more chill baby than Ellie was. Um, he does have reflux like Ellie does, but not as severe, I don't think. Uh, I just remember her being a very hard baby to settle, um, but she was a much better sleeper than Weston is. Oh man. As I said this morning, Weston just does not sleep at all. He, he likes to wake up every couple hours. Every once in a while he'll sleep for a little bit longer, maybe like three hours tops, but um, at this point Ellie was sleeping in five and six hour stretches and he's just not doing that yet. Also, 
I forgot to pick up coffee cream. So I have no coffee cream and I'm dying for coffee. I'm exhausted. <laughs> And because we were visiting with my parents today, um, I didn't get home until 3.30 and I forgot to take something to thaw out for supper. So I have no idea what we're going to do. You guys are in my cupboard right now and I'm looking at what we could possibly have for supper. I think I'm going to send Matt to pick up like a frozen pizza or something. It's just one of those days. It's a very long day. I didn't get much work done at all today. Not that I really needed to do a whole lot of anything. Um, it was mostly just packaging up a couple of things, but I put all my hard work into um, doing things over the last week or two, and I've worked really long hours because Weston has been extra clingy. Not that I mind in the least. It just makes it really hard to work especially when you don't have a nanny or a babysitter or anything like that so I have to stop what I'm doing and cuddle him and then when I do I find myself just like breathing him in and just basking in his cuddles and I don't go back to work <laughs> so I usually wait till Matt comes home and that Ellie goes to bed and he can hang out with Weston and normally I don't stop work until like midnight or one o'clock in the morning and I just don't sleep <laughs> I've um, I've put in all of the necessary time that I needed to and now I can do things quick things that would probably take you know 15 20 minutes um, and not have to worry about it so anyways thank you for spending the day with us it was not exciting by any means someday I'll record an exciting day in the life but that's just a little snippet of how today went I will talk to you guys another time bye